baseball. Isn't that dreadfully dull? Well, it requires a certain patience. <laughs> a certain lack of pulse, you mean. <laughs> I think uh, what my dad responds to is the game's nuance. Oh, well, yes, of course it has its merits. Yeah, I think my mother just means it's not exactly uh, action-packed. Right, but that would depend on how you look at it, right? Yeah, I mean, I suppose it does appeal to the more serious, more discerning crowd. Jim. What exactly does that mean? Just that actors, by their nature, aren't the most serious people in the world, right? Oh, is that so? So you think I'm not a serious person? How about if we dive into this dessert? Yeah. Because honestly, that whole death thing is sounding pretty good right now. There's been a murder downtown. Close enough. I'm so sorry that we have to run. You two be careful. Yeah, you guys too. You come from such different worlds. Yeah, well, your mom should have been more sensitive to that. Wait, what? Thanks, Pat. Ooh, you look nice. Lipstick, huh? Date night? No, it was dinner with her dad and my mom. Wow, already? How'd that go? Yeah, what exactly did you mean earlier when you said my mother could be more considerate? I just, I meant that I wish that you would have asked her to stop criticizing my dad. She was just expressing an opinion in much the same way your father was when he basically called my mom flighty and stupid. My dad never said that. Castle. You know what? Just drop it. Fine. We had dinner with the parents and her dad. My dad? More like your mom. Oh, oh, okay. So you guys, you're not just partners, you're... Uh, partners. I get it, okay. You know, I thought I would get used to this new part of Richard's life, the constant danger and the never knowing, and I, but I really thought there would come a moment, just a moment, when the worry would stop. Katie's been doing this for more than a decade now, and I, I've had this clench in my gut since the day they handed her the shield. She does say she always feels safest when your son's watching her back. He says the same thing about her. You said that they're from different worlds, and that we should just expect it. And then I started thinking about us. You're like this world-famous, best-selling author, and I'm just this cop, and... And we're in this relationship, which makes absolutely no sense on paper. And sometimes I just start wondering, are we just kidding ourselves? What if this bubble bursts? What are we then? Kate, we're not our parents. You can pick them up at the break room. Thank you. Well, I guess I can't avoid dealing with them forever. No, but you know what? Who cares if they don't get along? They aren't us. And so what if we don't make sense on paper? We don't live our lives on paper. And if we did, we'd never be astounded or surprised. How does that even happen? I don't know, but let's just, let's just, let's just go with it. Dad? 